Hey everyone, it's Project SBC and I'm here today to show you how to reset your OneMix 4 back to the default image. So if you've gone into Windows like you probably have in the past and tried to reset this PC, I'm going to say keep my files, it's going to say okay we're getting everything ready and then ah we couldn't recover. Okay so you're going to need a Windows installation USB or a CD and you may not want to deal with that. It actually turns out that there was a recovery image installed on the device as part of the factory installation process. So if I go into this D drive here that you may have noticed and we go in and unhide the hidden files we're going to see this recovery folder and in here we're going to see these .wim files. Turns out you can actually flash these images back onto your device and in order to do that we're going to have to go and get into the BIOS. So let's go ahead and restart. Once into the BIOS, we're going to head over to the boot menu option and we're going to select the first boot option to the UEFI OS. Enter, save changes and exit. We're going to restart into the recovery menu. Once in the recovery menu, we're going to click the system recovery option and we're going to hit start. It's going to take about 10 to 15 minutes, so please be patient. Once it's done resetting, it's going to restart several times, so still please be patient. On the last boot up, it goes into an administrator account. You get the option of changing how it boots up, but we're not going to make any changes. We're going to keep it out of box experience, click OK, and after a few seconds it will reboot on its own. It's going to reboot back into the familiar out-of-box experience you had when you first turned on your device. Now you can continue the setup like you did when you first got your device. So we are back into the Windows operating system. Everything seems to work. We've got touchscreen, sound, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth. It all seems to work. Screen rotation works. The one problem I did see was that my Linux installation, which was on this partition right here, is now deleted. So if you do have any other operating systems on any other partitions, expect to lose it. But otherwise, this reset it back. All the drivers seem to be working, so I don't have to go playing around with that. And you've got yourself a clean installed device. So if you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button, maybe even subscribe, and thanks for watching.